I'm Molly Argue for Young Hollywood, and today I'm going to introduce you to one of the world's biggest supermodels. Are you ready? I'm here with businesswoman, supermodel, and the mm -hmm. gorgeous Alessandra Ambrosio. Thank you. Hi. Welcome back from Thanks. Paris. I know. I just got here last night. It's like it's been it's been a crazy schedule. Well, you do not look like you just got off of an international <laughs> flight. You look amazing. Thank you so much. <laughs> of course, the Victoria's Secret Show is one of the most anticipated events of the year. But what's most exciting about this experience for you? Well, I think the most exciting experience for me this time was that we went to Paris right. and we got to fly on this private plane, like all the angels. We got there, we got to see like the Eiffel Tower. The city um, of love. Yes, the city of love. Like it's the most glamorous and romantic city in the world. And the show was there at the Grand Palais, which is incredible, like the roof. It's in, like just it's so nice to see everything, like the construction, the whole thing. Wow. So, you know, it's very iconic to be in Paris and with the show there it was probably you know, it was probably like the best show we ever had. One of the things I always get most excited about, though, is, of course, seeing all the different wings. Mm -hmm. You've worn a lot of wings. <laughs> yes. I've and I've heard that they can be, like, over 40 pounds sometimes. Is that true? It is true. I think this year there was one wing oh, that was over gosh. 40 pounds. I had to wear once a wing, like, maybe, like, four years ago. I wore, it was a 45-pound wing, and it was crazy to keep that thing in my shoulders and be able to walk and look pretty, you know, the whole thing is just like, it's it's insane, but, you know, it's always worth it. Yeah, and to remind everyone that's watching, she's walking a runway in like six inch heels, and there's usually yes. glitter and confetti, yes. and you have lights, and then you're wearing like, the 30, wings. 40 pound exactly. wings, it's a lot more difficult yeah. than I it was seems. lucky. I was lucky this year that I got to wear this two pound wings, it was so easy. And, you know, so I was like, okay, that's fine. But I did have heels, platform heels. They were like probably eight to oh ten inches. And that was hard. The Lady Gaga top all, all of us, she was wearing those heels. They were like, the, they were so massive. The platform she was wearing, it was incredible. And she looked great too. She looked amazing. How was being on stage with her and the weekend? Her energy was incredible. I didn't get to be with the weekend on the runway, oh, okay. but I was backstage and I was dancing <laughs> and I was out. rocking. And there was actually a video going on on Instagram of me like doing a selfie <laughs> video. And somebody filmed me and it's really stupid and <laughs> ridiculous, but it's kind of funny at the same time. And, but with Lady Gaga on the runway, it was amazing. She's such an amazing performer. She dances, like it's incredible the way she dances and sings. And she's a sweetheart. She gave us flowers oh, again. I like, love that. yeah, this is like the first time an artist, wow. you know, came to every angel, say thank you and congratulations. We were like, oh, oh my, you know, like who is this amazing woman? She's so sweet, wow. inspiring, and uh, it was, probably my favorite artist ever at the show. Speaking of the show, I have a feeling that maybe were any of these pieces mm -hmm. from the show? Can yes. we go back and take a look at what's sure. behind the display? Of course. I, I just love this whole this it's whole gorgeous. area here because it's the the new Dream Angel Wicked bra. Okay. So that's the newest bra we have and it's just so comfortable it's the I mean, angels that everybody knows it already you don't even want to put clothes on if that's what you're wearing exactly. because it's so pretty and you know like it's kind of a trend actually showing your bra now like yeah. this one here i was on the runway wearing the black version of this and, and it's hey it kind of matches my yes, velvet it's it. <laughs> <laughs> and it's so easy to wear like you want to show it off right. show off something like this it would this. be so cute with like high-waisted high leather pants and, yeah and so some cute. jacket that's a, you know, a little bomber jacket or something like that. I love it. Uh, and then we do have that one piece, magnificent. Uh -huh. I got to wear this during the commercial, the Christmas commercial, and it's just so beautiful, you know, and you can put a high waist pants and that's it. You're oh, ready for the true. holiday. You can wear it with like jeans uh, yeah. and a sweater. Or a skirt, anything you want, yeah. Or you can be super sexy and just go like exactly. that. Exactly, <laughs> just put a little coat on top. <laughs> well, I love it. I love it all in your an experienced angel. <laughs> so if you had to pick three words that describe what it takes to be an angel, what do you think those three words would be? Well, I think you have to be confident first, have attitude, and sexy. 
sexy. <laughs> and speaking of sexy, you've previously worn the fantasy bra, mm -hmm. and not many people can answer this question, but you can. Yeah. What does it feel like to be wearing 20 carats of diamonds on your chest? <laughs> it's fabulous. You know, it's like, it's such an honor. It's just, you know, you just feel fabulous. You feel so special with wow. all those diamonds all over you. <laughs> wow. What advice do you have for anybody who wants to just feel confident and sexy? Well, you know, like to me it's about, it comes from the inside mm -hmm. and it's about taking care of yourself, loving yourself, be healthy, work out, you know, and then wear the sexiest lingerie <laughs> you want. <laughs> if you got it, flaunt it. Yes. When you're not wearing the Victoria's Secret lingerie mm -hmm. on the runway, what little last minute tricks or tips do you have for working out and eating healthy when you need that extra little kick? To me it's like about having like some snacks uh, in your bag, like some healthy snacks, you know, so almonds, some nuts, things like that. And for workout, just try to, to walk everywhere. If you don't really have the time, you know, like or That's great. yeah, just like go up the stairs instead of taking the elevator, you know, do whatever it takes like to to be moving and be active. As Stay you active. Can. Yeah. yeah. That makes sense for sure. <laughs> Before we go, because mm -hmm. I may never have the chance to do this again, okay. to toss out the interview, can we do a supermodel walk to camera? Sure, let's <laughs> do it. Okay, usually we have music, but if we don't, just, you know. We'll pretend. Can, put your shoulders back, be as tall as you can, one leg in front of the other. Okay. And you just go for it and like, you know, in front of the other and get the hips going. And Ooh. when you get to the camera, can you blow a kiss? Yeah, you can do a kiss, you can look, you can do whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs> so fun! <laughs> Bye! <laughs>